Welcome to Dual Sport Maps Tutorials. I'm Strega and I'm going to be your host. First of all, uh, to do any downloading of maps or uploading, you need an account. On the top right here, click here. If you don't have an account, click Create Account. Fill out the required information here. Please click on Read Terms of Use. Read the Terms of Use here on the left side. Go ahead and create an account. So I'm going to go ahead and log in. Click I agree to the terms of use and click log in. Now it says hello Strega on the top right. I'm logged in. The first thing we're going to do is search the map for tracks. And to do that you click on search map for tracks. This button here on the top right. We're going to go ahead and zoom in on the map before we do that. I am going to search around the Grand Canyon. So I am going to click here on search map for tracks. The map dims a little bit. And you're just going to go ahead and click and drag, pulling the cursor down to the right-hand side. Click one more time. What it's going to do up here, loading tracks on the top left, it's going to load all the tracks that it's found in that area that I selected. So if I click on the old Spanish trail here, it's going to find the old Spanish trail. Or Page to St. George, just a simple little track on the highway there. That's actually a track I've updated, as you can see here, as part of our tutorials. Now if I click all tracks in the search area, it's a really neat feature. So in that area, it'll find any track that you want. Now if you, you click on that, there's a little feature called Copy to Clipboard. You can copy that specific track to your clipboard. A very cool feature if you're looking to create a map and you want to just piece together uh, some tracks. We're going to go over that clipboard a little bit later. Say, for example, this uh, Three Amigos four-day trip here. Let's say this looks like an interesting trip, and uh, I'd like to try it. To download it, on the bottom left here, you would click Download Map. It will allow you to download the file. I'm going to click Save. And uh, just know when you download that file, it's going to be a zip file. And inside of that zip file, uh, you're going to find three things. And that's going to be, as I will show in the folder here, and I will open this for you, you're going to see three files. A KML file you can open directly into Google Earth. And then you're going to have the modified and the raw file. This raw file is the original file that was uh, uploaded. And the uh, file above it here, this modified file, is the file as it is on the map that you're looking at uh, currently. Close out of there. One of the other things you can do is comment on a map. If you want to post, on the bottom left here, you can click on Post Comments. And what that does is uses the Facebook API to allow you to post comments here specifically about that track. Thanks for checking us out, and uh, hope to see you again soon.